Welcome to the Server Jockey install guide for Docker and Pterodactyl. This guide is intended for people who already have an understanding of these systems. To start, go to the README page on the Server Jockey GitHub. I'll put the link in the description. Scroll down to Docker image. So there's a link here to the Docker images on Docker Hub. So here are the uh, the tags, latest version is uh, 010. And over here you can get the pull request. So I have already logged in. And now I will run the pull command, which should be quick because I already have the image. And there it is. Now I can. Uh, Run the image uh, with um, the default port of the web app. And when it first starts, uh, it will run Steam CMD to update it. You'll also see the first run, you'll get these errors because Server Jockey is trying to start the Discord bot, but there's no login token set, so it fails. And here you can see the web app URL and login token. So the IP shown here for the web app is the, the Docker container IP. So what you wanna do is replace that, the IP of the, uh, the actual host. And there it is. That's the web app and uh, I'll just get the login token as well. There it is. So that's uh, Server Jockey running in Docker. And just uh, going back. So you can shut this down with Control C to send it a signal. So now on to Pterodactyl. Uh, there is an exported egg available, so you can just click on that and download it. So now that uh, I've got the egg file, I can go to Pterodactyl. This is the web panel. And I can go to nests. I have a server jockey nest already created. So now I can import the egg. and associate that with the server jockey nest. It doesn't have to be in a nest called server jockey. You can create uh, any one that you want. And there it is, imported. So I'll uh, make this a little bigger so it's more uh, readable. So now you can go to servers, create a new server, call it uh, demo. Note that the default port allocation will be for the web app, not any of the games. So you will add some additional ports as needed for any games that you run. Select the egg that you want and create server. So it's uh, currently installing and it's ready. So let's start this and uh, see how it goes. Oh, it's already starting. So it's uh, downloading uh, Steam CMD and I'll uh, just fast forward this. So the system has started. Uh, Steam CMD will be updated every time the container is started. Uh, also the same as Docker, we're seeing errors from the Discord bot because no login token has been set. Again, we'll see the URL 
uh, and login token. Uh, the URL will contain the IP of the Docker container. So instead, uh, just use the address that Pterodactyl gives you. And you will find the login token for the web app in the console as well. And uh, there we go. That's it.